her female. That's the same size as her female. Oh, how pretty. She's pretty. Yeah, she's Hi, pretty. Clumsy. The other one's a merle. Oh. This one's what? Eight I've never weeks? heard of the merle. Anyway. How old is this one? This one's eight weeks. Eight weeks. But she's only gonna get like. But the money. the little one you was telling me about this yeah. six weeks is in the house. Yeah. Why, the house. why is there one? These are eight and it's six. I had three litters. Oh. And it's the only one you haven't gotten rid of out of that litter. No, I, I haven't gotten rid of any of those. Oh. Hey, baby. I don't get rid of mine until they're eight weeks old. Hey, baby, baby, baby. And they get their first shots. And everything. Yeah. I want to thank RV Mattress by Brooklyn Bedding for sponsoring today's video. Do you need a mattress for your home or RV? Brooklyn Bedding has many sizes to fit most. You get a 10-year warranty, free shipping, and best of all, they've got a plant down here in Phoenix, Arizona. So go to <clears throat> rvmattress.com slash campervankevin. Use the coupon code campervankevin to get 25% off your purchase. Okay? Okay. Now, back to our regularly scheduled programming. Hey, baby May May. Oh, look at there. You got double ponytails. Double ponytails. I, I got a haircut, too. Looking good, Tuck. Looking good. I know. You got to go on a diet. I love your hair, baby May May. We got a new groomer. And Martini, she got double ponytails too. I like it. Got her nice and shaved up for warmer weather. We'll be heading We'll be heading to warmer weather soon. Put your tongue back in, baby. Alright. Why why can't we go? Because there's gonna be other dogs there. There's gonna be other dogs. I'll be back in a little bit. My babies. Oh, how I love my babies. Hey, everybody. Camper Van Kevin here. How are y'all doing today? Mm -hmm. Me, I'm doing pretty good. Getting things ready to uh, kind of, well, leave Vagabond soon. Uh, got a lot to do, got a lot to do. But the reason for this video, uh, I go to the uh, Snowflake flea market quite often over at the Snow Snowflake Taylor area. And uh, today, um, there was a lady there selling chihuahuas. Not teacup chihuahua, but the next size up. It's supposed to get about four or five pounds. Here's some pictures of them. All right, so why do I care? Well, Carolyn, she's the lady that, uh, that stays in the leprechaun out here at the end of the property. She's done all this landscaping work and everything. Well, she recently lost her little um, tiny, tiny chihuahua, uh, Harley. Uh, she had had him for 15 years. It's been two, three, four months now. And, uh, well, Carolyn's hurting. And she's grieved Harley and she's grieved Harley. And I think it's time that, well, I know it's time that she got another dog. Uh, she's been looking and looking, hadn't had any luck. So anyway, long story short, we call the lady. Carolyn didn't go to the uh, flea market. But we call the lady. I got her number while I was there. And she didn't sell any of the puppies today. So we're going to go by her house. And we're going to take Carolyn and see if any of these puppies meet Carolyn's needs. She says, don't buy me one, Kevin. I want to play with each one. I want to see if 
we have any kind of you know attachment or whatever she said I'm very very picky and I don't blame her I don't blame her uh, are we gonna get a chihuahua today I don't know we're gonna go look you wanna go with us well, come on go with us I'm gonna ride with my friend here they're gonna drive and Carolyn will be getting in the back soon so no I'm not driving uh, not all my friends uh, want to be on YouTube so we're gonna respect that but uh, we're gonna go up here and pick up Carolyn and head to Sholo. Full tiny house has moved over to their property so they can be closer to their work. Here's Miss Carolyn, the hardest working person I know. Didn't know which side. Yep, yep. Brought my famous purse. All right, Miss Carolyn, well, we don't know if these are the puppies you're looking for. You said, uh, you told me Harley, how much did he weigh when he was an adult? Three pounds. Three pounds. So we know these chihuahuas aren't as, as small, right. but they are still small. She said that they were supposed to get up to what, four pounds? Yeah, she said they were called mini, mini chihuahuas. I've never heard of mini chihuahuas. I hadn't either, but she's an AKC registered breeder, has AKC dogs. So we'll go see what she's got. We'll do something even if it's wrong. <laughs> So we're headed to Sholo in an element that used to be mine. Uh, this windshield was just replaced and in just uh, no time at all, this one was repaired, this crack. This one happened today. There's a couple more. There's just no way to keep a windshield here. So if you live in this area, you live in Arizona, you need to get windshield coverage. I can't keep one in my any of my stuff or the element. When we're getting close, this is the area between Snowflake and St. John's. I'm just, uh, I don't think this, this land is near as pretty as Concho. It's more flat. There is less rocks, but a lot more sand. But it's cheap land if you're looking for cheap land. Everybody's gotta stay somewhere. All right. Got some dirt roads. Yeah, mailboxes are over here. Primitive <laughs> road. Caution. Use at your own risk. Surface may not be marked. Oh, this one's not marked. There go junipers. This part of Arizona has some of the best dirt roads I've ever seen in my life. And I grew up in Georgia. Our roads were never this nice. Great. Now the roads got a little bit more narrow. Nothing like country living. That's the same size as Harley. <laughs> oh, how pretty. She's pretty. Yeah, she's pretty. Hi, Clunky. Clunky. The other one's a Merle. Oh. This one's what? Eight I've weeks? never heard of a Merle. How old is this one? This one's eight weeks. Eight weeks. But she's only going to get like. But the, the little one you was telling me about this yeah. six weeks is in the house? Yeah. Why, uh -huh. why is there one? These are eight and it's six. I had three litters. Oh. And it's the only one you haven't gotten rid of out of that litter? No, I, I haven't gotten rid of any of those. Oh, hey, baby. I don't get rid of mine until they're eight weeks old. Hey, baby, baby, baby. And they get their first shots. And yeah. Yeah, the mama and daddy? Yeah, they're in the house. Oh, this that is, was this the, is the boy? No. And this, is, this one here is the little boy, the Merle. That's the toy. They're toys. Yours was a teacup. These are toys. Yeah. Look at that little black spot. Oh, okay. So you've raised, you've raised Mama. You've raised Chihuahua for a while. There's Mama. Now they're gonna get it her she's size. Got... No, she'll. Don't... These two will be even smaller than her, and she's small for her. Well, what I'm going by is the length of the legs. Yeah, so. she's long. She's a deer leg. Though. She's a deer leg. These guys got the okay. short legs. Oh. That's the little. That's the little that's boy. The, yeah, the little boy. He looked tired. They just got home. Yeah, they've been out all day at yeah. the flea market. So you've yeah. raised chihuahuas for a while? 30 years. 30 years. I Got love chihuahuas. a good chihuahuas. reputation. Ask anybody around here. I'm going to take mine. Yeah. All right. I'm going to take mine. Oh, meaty, meaty. Yeah, I'll take them. Yeah, they, they were born a little smaller. Yeah. 
The smallest one is still in there. Hey, Joe, that's a girl. Hey, Joe. Oh, yeah. It was born tiny. Hey, Joe. I like that color. What do you call that? That's Merle. Oh, that is Merle. Will it get darker? No. It'll get lighter, if anything. Hmm. Itty bitty. And she wants to see Emma, too. Huh? And she wants to see Emma, too. If you want to hold these guys up, you get her. Emma, too, is. <laughs> Emma. Do you have a boy in this litter? Huh? Or two girls. Two girls. Comes the tiniest of them all. Yeah. Oh, so she her. was the runt, and you had you know No, she her. was. She was almost. The, I saved her life. Oh. Are you cold? That wind got you. She's doing good now. Though. Oh, she's doing really she good. How come that one ear won't stay? Her ears both did that, and it, it'll come. It'll come up and then stand up. <laughs> she's scared right now. So. Oh. But it's, uh, this one chewing on her too. ear. It won't stay, back, stay forward. <laughs> it's from her chewing on her ear. <laughs> <laughs> My ear's stuck that way. And that's Miss Little Emma Ooh, She's so itty bitty. Mm -hmm. She is. She's itty bitty. But I saved her life. I had to give her air and everything. And I fed her every two and a half hours for four weeks. Mm -hmm. hmm. She was really tiny when she was born. She was about she like that. She took that. Yeah. So she's got an ear that needs a little work. What do you think, Carolyn? We'll see. I don't know. What's her name? Cutie Pie? Huh? Cutie Pie? I don't know. But she said, I was saying that she's going to take more than mm -hmm. most people want to do with a puppy. Mm. So. Good kitty. Yeah. yeah, that's why I was suggesting one of the toys. Yeah. Oh. What you done, huh? What you done, done, hon? Went and bought a job. Yeah? Yeah. Now listen. Everybody's going to say, oh, you should go adopt a dog and she go to the pound. Well, Carolyn's done that. No. This time she wanted a specific dog. She's, she's, she's taking care of strays. She's went to the pound. She's got those kind of dogs. She's very specific in what she wanted. And she'll make a good mom out of this dog. So y'all just keep those comments to yourself. She got exactly what she wanted. And that's what we did. No names, ideas? You going? No, the she, her middle name is going to be Rose, but what her first name is going to be, I don't know. She'll pick it. All right. Call her every name in the book till she finds out which one she wants and responds to. That's the best way to. If you want your dog to always do what you want a dog to do, then let them pick their own name. So that's my seatbelt. Seem to respond. You named a lot of dogs and what? They didn't respond as good or as oh, hold on, baby. <laughs> okay, so uh we got a little surprise for you, Carolyn. Uh you paid for half the dog. And uh well the other half don't worry about it. Why? Because all the work and stuff you've done at Vagabond. No, 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 you know, baby, that ain't right. I didn't do all that yes, for you, money. I know you didn't, but you, you blessed uh, you blessed me, so let me bless you back. That's not right. It is right. So, you paid for half, and we got the other half. Well, thank you. <laughs> now you got you a baby. Okay, well, we got back to camp. Got my uh, comforter up here behind the driver and passenger seats to hold in the heat at night. Uh, anyway, we got back to camp. Frank and Tammy had some scales, put the new puppy on there. The puppy weighed just a little bit over one pound. Uh, entered that into uh, Chihuahua growing how big they'll get by the weight and the age they are now. Said the puppy will get about five pounds. 
So not a teacup, but not a full-size Chihuahua either. Um, Carolyn couldn't be happier. There hasn't been a name yet. If you have any uh, girl uh, name ideas, please put them down in the comments below. Uh, Carolyn says she's going to let her name herself. So whenever she says a name and the puppy seems excited, that might be what she goes with. But maybe she'll read some of your comments out loud. All right, well, I think that's going to make today's video. Um, I'm, uh, I'm glad you got to hang out with us today. We've got a new member to the Vagabond RV base camp here in Concho. Uh, it's been a good day. And again, Carolyn has done all kind of rescues. Um, I know people say adopt, don't shop. Carolyn's done all those things and she wants a very specific dog and that's what she got so we're just gonna leave it at that but I'm gonna end today's video where right here I appreciate each and every one of you thank you guys so much for watching my videos hey we'll see you again soon you guys take care and as always what I give God the glory for my life Jesus Christ he's my Lord and Savior see you next video Bye from Concho, Arizona.